children. I hope you're all doing well. Today we are going to have another interesting lesson. I want you to be attentive. The topic is tourism. During our leisure time, some people have game, some would want to rest, some would also want to relax. Others also travel to other places to enjoy some facilities. And with it, what is tourism? We say tourism is an activity which involves traveling to see and enjoy facilities and sceneries in other places. The sceneries refer to beautiful general outlook of man-made and natural features of a landscape. So, like I said, the sceneries, it could be an artificial made or natural made. An example of an artificial outlook is the canopy walk at Kakum National Park. This walkway was made by man. An example of a natural scenery is Boti Waterfall. This was made by God. Now let me ask you, where do people go to to have fun or to relax during their leisure time? Let's look at some of tourist sites in Ghana. So we have a picture on our screen. Can you please identify this picture? This is a walkway at Kakum National Park. Can you identify this also? The umbrella rock. Boabin Fiema Monkey Sanctuary. This is the Larambaga Mosque. I hope you can also write other interesting places you know. Now one may ask, why do we go on tour? Or reasons why people go on tour? There are a lot of reasons why people go on tour. But today we are going to focus on this. In this picture, we can see some students in a forest reserve. Now, these students are there on an educational tour. Sometimes students go on tour on educational reasons to know the history behind the establishment of certain tourist sites in Ghana. How we can describe this picture to we have people in a festival. So people attend festivals to acquire knowledge about their cultural heritage. In this picture, we have people at the beach. They're having fun. Good. So people normally go to the beach to relax and to enjoy themselves. In this picture too, we have a pond. And along the pond, we have a crocodile and a lady. So tourists go on tour to appreciate nature. That is, they go on tour to appreciate the beauty 
of God's creation. Now, to end our lesson, today we have learned that tourism is an activity which involves traveling to see and enjoy facilities and sceneries in other places. In this lesson, we have known that people go on tour for educational purposes, people go on tour to acquire knowledge about their cultural heritage, people go on tour to relax and enjoy themselves. Children, I hope you enjoyed the lesson. There are questions in the learning, the Ziba learning zone. Kindly answer them. Thank you.